She come in here to check on him. He was cooking. She's like, let me just help you. Fire! No, I knew it! I knew it! We have a fire and Edric is standing there! No, get up! Put him out! Oh, and is she breaking out the trumpet? She's like, yes! Easter! Look at it! They're hugging! Wow! Oh, and then she's... Oh, she immediately beat an ornery! Oh, look at She's so mad! She had an aggravating conversation with her sister, and now she's so very mad. She is so stressed. She's like, I just can't get through to you! Why you gotta be so difficult, Rose? I just don't get it! Why can't you be nice? Hello, all you fabulous and wonderful people. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back for some more of the ultimate decades challenge. So it is currently Saturday. It is the third quarter of 1343. We're going to be going into 1344 soon, but tomorrow is going to be Easter. It is Sunday. Hopefully we can get the family to come over, but we're just going to be taking care of our farm and the animals and everything. Also, I'm going to be selling this sheep. I really didn't know how to get beige wool. So in the last episode, I was trying to make these things. I can pay the money outright. You don't have to have these all on hand, but I just, I like to because it makes it more realistic and it gives me my sim, my sim something to do. So I like to try and get this wool. Beige wool, I found out comes from beige llamas. That makes sense. I guess I forgot that there is a white llama and a beige llama. So I have custom content animals, so I'm going to try, I'm going to sell this and see, I'm going to have to see if I can get an animal that is beige so we can get that wool because those rugs, a lot of them take the beige wool. So I am hopefully going to be able to get that done here in just a little while. I'm also thinking that Edric is going to go out hunting as well. Maybe he can get a pheasant or something for Easter because I don't think that we have any like whole turkey or, you know, big game. Yeah, we've cut every we've cut it all up into meat, so we don't really have any like whole meat like they would have, like maybe a better a nicer meal to celebrate Easter with. So, hopefully we can get him to go hunting at some point. And we do have a brown hen that is getting on in here, so we'll have to get rid of that hen. And this dog, Honeydew, has come to bark at Christina, who is sleeping soundly. And the dog didn't get her attention, so Honeydew came over here and just laid down. It's, it's hiding now. And she's dreaming about death? What? Are we dreaming about death? What are these kids dreaming about? And I do see Marilda is up. She thinks she's going to cook a roast chicken for breakfast, y'all. But no, she's not. She's going to grab some of this meat and cheese. Actually, you know what? Instead of grabbing some of that, let's see if you can make something. Maybe I'll have her make this. This actually sounds pretty good. I'm going to have her make this. This kind of breakfasty, I don't know. Edric needs to get up here. I'm going to have him use this pot up in here. And the girls are all going to get themselves around and they're going to take care of the animals. They're going to get something to eat first and then they can go about their day doing all of the chores. And there she is baking a spinach tart there. Oh, and I don't know what's happened here, but I just heard, oh, you broke everything. Okay, you know what? I'm going to have him go ahead and, and repair these things. That way he can get his handiness up a bit. He broke the pot and the sink. What is going on? And there she has breakfast on the table. Oh, that does look kind of good, doesn't it? All right. Well, you can go ahead and grab some of that. Grab a serving. You're not going to go talk to Edric just yet. And then he can come down and grab a serving. Everybody can come have themselves some of this delicious tart that she has made. And she is going to, I think these, these clothes can probably get put away. And then she can add some flowers. We're going to go ahead and add an orchid and she can get started on this laundry. And Christina, I'm going to have her talk to little honeydew and she's going to get to know and she's going to hug. And she is gonna brush this dog. And you also need to come out here and fill this up. Fill this bowl up. And here he is working hard trying to fix this pot. It got a hole in it. And these girls are sitting here talking. You never know what these two are gonna do. 
and it looks like she wants to play make-believe, but Christina is just paying more attention to the dog. Maybe that would make her upset. I don't know. She's like, I'm gonna just brush my dog a little bit. And he finally got that all done, and he is miserable. Here she is, up early, doing the laundry, getting everything cleaned. Spick and span. And he's just sitting here talking with his sister. Edric is gonna clean these sheds. And Rose is going to collect the eggs. And tomorrow is Easter. Oh, we got a hatchable egg. Wait a minute, we got a hatchable egg. So we're gonna have her go ahead and try and hatch it. It is normal. So we'll incubate that in the coop. Then Marilda is going to come over here and she is going to spray for bugs. We are currently halfway through the spring. So I think once we, we're going to harvest these if they're ready. It looks like they're ready. But she's going to spray for bugs and stuff and weed first. I think I will have little Christina come here and help her mom. She took an interest in gardening, so I think I'll have her do that. I do have some to evolve, and I will evolve all of these. Like, all of these are able to evolve. Very nice. Okay, so he is all done, and he'd like to have fun. I will let him play a little chess. Look at it. They're hugging. Wow. Oh, and then she, oh, she immediately beat an ornery. She was immediately being ornery. She's like, I give you a hug, and then she scolds her. Wait a minute. <gasps> Festering bitterness, stressed by strangers. I don't know what that's all about. And how are we even family? Oh, my gosh. And she's like, you suck. <laughs> you, you suck, Christina. Oh, Christina, I'm going to have you come over here and water these all. Let's have you water, and you can weed them, actually, as well. And maybe we'll have Rose do the same. Can she water? I guess these don't need any watering. Oh, wait. Yeah, it does. You can water these. Oh, look at She's so mad. She had an aggravating conversation with her sister, and now she's so very mad. And then she's energized. I'm really going to have to look for a mod that fixes how long they stay into these moods because they just flip in between these moods so quickly. It's just a little bit ridiculous. So I know there's a mod out there that does let them stay in it a bit longer. So I'm going to be looking for that. The girls are just out here helping their mother, helping mom out in the garden. Just going to weed and we got one watering and she's spraying for bugs. And it looks like everything is ready to harvest. So I think I'm gonna, after the girls get done weeding and all of that, I think I will have her harvest this stuff. Oh, I do need to get rid of this animal. Let's have Edric. Edric is gonna go ahead and trade this white sheep for ingredients and produce. Yes, we would like to get rid of the sheep and we'll see if we can get a beige uh, something that produces beige, if not a l actual llama. So yeah, the, we need the beige llama. It doesn't say what kind of wool it makes. I'm wondering if this is in place of the beige llama. We do have a brown sheep. I'm curious to see if maybe that produces beige um, wool. So I'm thinking, I'm thinking that any of these, like a black horse, a brown, uh, a black horse, a brown donkey, Brown horse, brown sheep produce beige. I'm going to try this brown sheep and see if that one will produce beige wool. So let's go ahead and feed the sheep and we will clean and we'll socialize a little bit with this, with this brown sheep. And I don't know what she's doing over here. These girls have come over here and they are going out here behind the sheds. I hope this is a friendly conversation, girls. And they're talking about cleaning. Okay, so she's coming over here to uh, do some more of this laundry. And you can go ahead and do the laundry. Oh no, he hurt himself. It didn't go so well. Okay, next harvest is white wool. Dang it, we're gonna have to sell it. I, I think I just might have to purchase a beige llama to get this beige wool that I want. Let's try a black horse. <laughs> we just go through them all and see. Oh, and this dog does need a bath. White wool, dang it. But this is cute. Are they all just gonna be white? I have a feeling they might all produce white wool. White wool. Dang. 
Okay, I'm just gonna get a llama. I am just gonna get a beige la la llama. I can't talk. Trade for simoleons. Yep. I wish it said in the description whether it was beige or white. And it doesn't. So, I am gonna just get this. We're just gonna have to get this beige llama to get the, the wool that I want. And let's go ahead. Okay, there we go. Now we can feed this llama and socialize with this llama. Let's make some friends so that we can get its wool for our mom. She's like, I don't want to talk to you, Edric. He's like, come on. These girls, you know, for not getting along, they just, why do they want to even be around each other? And now she's stressed. She's so stressed. She's like, I just can't get through to you. Why you gotta be so difficult, Rose? I just don't get it. Why can't you be nice? Oh, she is just really upset with her. Oh, she's like, I don't like it. She's like, what about fitness, Christina? Oh, and now she's got to insult her. Oh, no. She's just like, Christina, you just don't seem to get anything. You just do not understand. So it looks like we got six beige wool. We're going to give this beige wool to Marilda. There we go. And I did not pay attention to this. Oh, it's pristine and damp. Good. She got that all done. And it's 4 p.m., y'all. By the time you do all the laundry, all of the gardening, all of the animals, it's evening. I mean, I guess that's accurate. They would spend all day taking care of everything on the farm. Oh, my gosh. It just That's all they can do. I'm going to have her come in here and grab a little something to eat. And then she's going to clean this. I guess it gets dirty. But now we should be able to make things. Okay, we do need black wool, it looks like, and red wool. So she's going to have to make some of that. We'll have Edric come over here. He's going to have some of this stuff. This does last quite a while. She made this in the morning and it's still got 14 hours on it. That's pretty good. Did Honey do get her bath now? No. Honey do did not get a bath. What did you do in there, Edric? I didn't pay attention, but what did you do? I'm going to have Marilda give this dog a bath. Little Rose, you're being naughty. No, 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 no. We are going to yell at her for making a mess. And then we are going to make her clean it up. She's like, you cannot make this mess, Rose. Oh, and she's going to act crazy now. Oh, and then she automatically is going to insult her sister. She just got a scolding too. And now she's going to insult her sister. And she's cleaning up after her dog. What a good girl. She's cleaning up after her dog. Wait, where are you going exactly? I told you to in clean, make her clean that up. She's going all the way over here to go make her clean it up. What? And she's going to sit down. And then she get What? This is routing. I'm going to tell you why. It's so... It's just... Oh, my gosh. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so he has got this done. I don't know what he thinks he's doing in there, but he needs to come in here and have himself a bath, I think. Oh, boy. He's got to repair that first. And she's watching her. She's just watched her clean that up. She's like, hey, I got an idea. Why don't you be nice to your sister? It's a good idea. Oh, no, the dog is rolling around. Why did you not fix this? I'm just going to replace it. I just can't even. All right, you need to give this dog a bath. There we go. Come on, get in there. We're going to give you a bath. And they're all getting themselves something to eat. And I am going to have her come over here. She can make some of this black wool or dye let's have you make some black dye and he is gonna finish taking this giving this dog a bath and he's gonna have himself a bath oh and here the girls are sitting down to some dinner hopefully they can talk nice oh they just don't like each other at all man they just don't get along Oh, and she's cleaning up for her sister. That was nice. And I guess she got this dye done. And we'll put that in here. And we're going to make a cup. Not ingredients. Yo, not ingredients. We did need red. So we'll go ahead and have her do that. And then I'm going to have her do another black one. And Christina is cleaning up. She does need to come up here and use this pot. Rose is just sitting there. I'm going to have her clean out the spoiled food out of the pantry. Okay, she got this done. Oh, I guess she's in the way, so it crossed it out. All right, well, let's just go ahead and make some yarn now. We can make black. Oh, we need seawater. Can we still collect it? I think it might be too late. 
in the evening for her to go out and collect it. Oh, no, we can. I'm just going to send her out since Edric is getting having himself a bath and stuff. I'm going to have these girls be doing some stitching. I think these are all resume. Okay, she don't have that one done. And resume. She is getting tired. Christina is. So I guess she got it done. I'm going to have her do another one. She is going to stitch pattern. We're going to do nature. We'll do a medium hoop. And we'll do a pumpkin. Edric is going to play a little bit of chess before he goes to bed. And she is still out. Oh, and we've got all of these hairballs up here, yo. Oh, no. The dog has puked everywhere. She's like, I just don't want to fight with my sister anymore. So I'm just going to sit up here and do my stitching. And she can stay down there. Okay, she is back with the sea salt. So now can we go ahead and let's make, not ingredients, Um, let's make some of this. We can make black yarn. And I'm going to have him go. They're going to be getting pretty tired. She, oh, <laughs> Christina's already put herself to sleep. And she's actually not tired, so I'll let her still stitching. But Edric is getting tired. Okay, and we got this is all done. Oh, we already have some black yarn. Why can we not make anything then in here? Black wool. Oh, we don't need the yarn. We need the black wool. Oh, no. Oh, well, we can make this one. I, when it said black wool, I just, my mind was thinking yarn. I mean, <laughs> it's not this. This is not what we need over here. I'm going to have her go ahead and make this one. Okay, she got that done. I'm going to send her off to bed. It is getting a little bit late. Go off to bed. And she's like, nah, I don't want to go off to bed. And she come out here, talk to these plants. Um, Yeah, she did get this one done. So we'll put that in our inventory. And can she make more? She can make another one of those. We do really need the black wool. We'll have her do one of these other rugs out of silk. Well, that's not half bad. That's kind of nice. All right, I'm going to have her go up here and go to bed. It is almost midnight and uh, she can take care of herself. She's going to have a busy day of uh, cooking for Easter. Oh, and Rose is going through a phase. She will pick up an instrument. Any chance she gets and yell often and turn up all the radios up to 11. Oh no, she is going through a phase. Loud. It's very early. I'm going to make her go back to bed and she can get a little bit more sleep. And it is Easter and Marilda is up and feeling flirty. <laughs> okay, it is six in the morning and this has got one hour on it. I'm going to have her grab some. Oh, she was going to get some on her own anyway. And I'm going to have him come down and get some of that. And oh, is that the last serving? That was the last serving of it. So actually, I'm going to have him make something. I'm going to see what he can make just to get his cooking up a little bit. Because, you know, when he gets married, he might have to cook from time to time. He could make some boiled eggs. Let's make a family size of the boiled eggs. She come in here to check on him. He was cooking. She's like, let me just help you. Let me give you some pointers on how to boil those eggs, Edric. Oh, and he's burning himself. What are you doing? She's overseeing him, making sure he's not going to ruin anything. He doesn't look very happy about this. Fire! No, I knew it! 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 I knew it was going to happen. No! No fire! Wait a minute! Put out! No! Put out! Marilda's discovered a fire. Oh no, we have a fire and Edric is standing there. No, get up, put him out. <gasps> put him out right now. <gasps> put him out, extinguish, extinguish. Oh my gosh. Oh, that was a close call. Oh, he's like singed. All right. Okay, no more cooking for you, Edric. I should have known better. What was I thinking? Now we're going to have to get a new stove. I think we can just replace this. Let's just replace it. And we'll have Marilda. Oh, <laughs> what was I thinking? I thought it's just eggs. It will be easy. It will be easy. And no, it is not easy. Just caught himself on fire. Oh, he's so stressed. And we're going to need to come over here and take care of all these animals here. I'm going to, as soon as Rose gets done eating, she can come over here and uh, feed this cow. 
and clean this cow. We don't need any more milk, so we'll just feed and clean them. And we'll have her come over here. Is this probably dirty? Yeah, it is. We'll go ahead and scatter the feed and scatter this feed. Oh, I do think I have a chicken to get rid of. We'll collect the eggs and clean this coop. I'm going to have Marilda, as soon as she's done with this, she can sell this chicken. So it looks like we have an adult, we have a young adult, and we have an adult, and we have an elder. It is the brown hen that needs to get rid of. Oh, and this one is afraid of the stove now. Little honeydew is afraid of the stove because it caught fire. Yes. Okay, now you can come have yourself some of this eggs. Oh my goodness, I cannot believe he caught himself on fire. Brown hen has been traded. All right, she's gonna make some baked apples is what she's gonna make. And we're gonna get the family around here in just a bit and we're gonna go ahead and cook this dinner. Oh, I was gonna have him go out hunting. I'm gonna have him come over here and use this and then he is gonna go out hunting really quick. Let's see if he can't get something. Okay, she got all of these cleaned. I'm gonna have her go ahead and feed this and clean this llama. Did we get all these sheds? Did not get cleaned. So I'm gonna have Rose do it or Christina is gonna do one and she can do this other one since he's gonna go out hunting. And there she has the baked apples. And we're gonna get her to pay some attention to this dog. She is gonna brush this dog and take care. Oh, we do need to also fill this and fill this bowl. These are all clean now. Very good, girls. You did a great job. You got it all cleaned up. Very good. And she's just gonna feed her dog before she goes off to water the plants. Edric should be coming back soon. Yeah, it's coming back soonish. You know what? Let's go ahead and harvest all of these things. I think we'll have her spray these for bugs. We do seem to have a few. Oh, we can evolve these. And then I'm gonna have her go ahead and harvest everything because we could probably use this in our cooking. And these girls are talking, she's talking about money and maybe she's dreaming about someday she would marry some rich guy, some rich prince. Oh, and they're fighting again. What in the world? They're just fighting. How are we even family? Oh my gosh, she's like throwing a fit. Oh, she's throwing, she's so mad. And what is she going to go do? She's going to go throw away eggs, I guess. Oh my gosh, she's just literally, Christina is throwing such a fit right now. And she's going to be ornery with her. She was going to go scare her sister. Okay, did we harvest this stuff? Go ahead and harvest. She's too uncomfortable to do this, yo. Oh, she's like, no, I can't. I can't do it. It's too wormy. It's too squiggly. All right, he is back. So what did we get? He got a small rabbit. He got a wild boar and he did get a pigeon. Unfortunately, I do not think that those are anything. We'll have him come here and cut this up. We'll put the boar in here. I think we could probably do something with the boar. What can we make here? We could make venison steak. I guess that's kind of a fancy meal. Roasted pheasant. You do need pheasant and potato. Let's see what else we can make. Can't make a lot of much of anything. Um, we could make salted boar. No, we don't have sea salt. I guess she's gonna end up, the only thing we can really make is this venison steak. So maybe we could make that. Oh, we can only make a single serving because we need green beans and potatoes. Aw, oh, dang. I guess we won't be having a nice meal with our family. Maybe we can make a tart. She could make a pigeon pie. Okay, maybe she will just do that. All right, well, we'll do that when we get the family. I'm going to have her go ahead and get the family around. Okay, here is Juliana. And she's like, oh, Juliana, how you doing? She, oh, she's so mad. She is so mad. And Cecilia has come over. And here comes Roger. And here is Jonetta has just come in. Oh, my gosh, there's so many family. The Sam This family is so big. I just... Hi, oh, there's so many Sims over here. And she's just like, hey, how you doing? We're gonna have her come over here to Marietta. And we're going to talk with her a minute. Oh, she's so mad. 
She's tense. We can boast about our family. What do we need to do? We need to tell stories. So we will do that. We'll tell a wedding story. Why not? Christine and Edric now has a difficult family. You know what? I'm thinking is I'm starting to think that it's Christina that has a problem with all these these Sims. She now has a difficult relationship with her brother Edric, and she has one with uh, her. I think I think she is gonna be a picky Sim. I think this girl is just not going to be easy to please this Christina as well. I'm thinking we're going to discuss world peace with her. We're going to sing about Easter and we're going to have her sing to her aunt. Friendly introduction. Apparently she's never met her aunts over here. These are Merilda's sisters. And she's singing now to Juliana. She's singing Easter. Oh, and is she breaking out the trumpet? She's like, yes. Easter so we're gonna get her to do the same sing about Easter I don't know why she didn't get this caught off. She did not get this Counted practice singing. Oh, I guess they have to actually sing on themselves Maybe and she's over here and she's just <laughs> blah 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 and I don't know what they're all out here talking about. And these girls are in here. We have Cecilia's daughter, Mabel. Okay, we just got the singing. She likes singing. Marilda likes to sing. Marilda's talking with her dad and her sister. And this is Eleanor, which is Cecilia's mother-in-law and her sister. And they're all talking. And I'm going to have her make some dinner she's gonna go ahead and make this ven venison it's really the only oh not the venison we can't make this it's not big enough how about fried fowl yo make a party size of the fried f i can't talk fried fowl we do still need to tell some stories and he hasn't sang yet so i'm gonna have him oh he's too tense to do this he's still stressed out about this he does need a bath so I'm going to have him come take a bath. Maybe that will help him. She's singing the whole time. She's just standing here singing to her heart's content for like hours. I should really get going now. Oh, no. Don't leave. And they're all leaving because they came over so early. All right. Fine. Just leave. We're going to call everybody to this meal. Even though that's not something we have to do. I'm just doing it. And she's talking about our dirty house, I guess. Call to meal. And she's just literally singing. Okay, you can stop singing, yo, and get yourself something to eat. And they still have to go off to the ceremony. At least uh, Edward, Edric and Marilda. I'm going to send them. It is evening. I'm going to have them go ahead and uh, go off to the ceremony here. Attend holiday ceremony. Everybody can go. And this one was practicing singing out here by herself. <laughs> Oh, she needs to go off to the ceremony. I should really get going now. All right. And Edric has come back and he is like really tired. I'm going to have him use the pot here. He can use that. And uh, he's getting himself something to eat. And they've all come back. I'm going to have them. I'm going to have Christina here. She's going off to bed. That is fine. I'm going to have her clean up. And Marilda is off to bed, apparently. Actually, you could use this. And then go to sleep. I'm going to try and get these girls to do tell some stories to each other before they go off to bed here. Stories. Tell a make-believe story. And every time they come in the kitchen here, every time they come in here, they get the stressed fire buff. They immediately remember the fire. Oh, she didn't like the story. She did not like the story, apparently. We're going to go ahead and tell her a story now. And she got that checked off. She can go up and the girls can go off to bed. Although she does need a toilet here. And Easter is over. Easter was pretty good for Christina. It was pretty good for Rose. And it really wasn't up to Edric's expectations. And Marilda didn't even get anything. We didn't even get one for Marilda. Wait. Oh, no. It was good for Marilda. All right, you guys. I think I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here. So we had a pretty decent holiday. We had some of the family over. We, you know, worked on the farm. So I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. If you haven't yet subscribed, it would be amazing if you did. And also, don't forget to click the little bell to get notified whenever I have a video go up. And I hope you all have a great rest of your day. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.